Numbers, Numbers 1 The Lord spoke to Moses in the wilderness of Sinai in the tent of meeting on the first day of the second month in the second year after they had come out of the land of Egypt, saying, Take a census of all the congregation of the people of Israel, by clans, by fathers' houses, according to the number of names every male, head by head. From twenty years old and upward, all in Israel who are able to go to war, you and Aaron shall list them company by company. And there shall be with you a man from each tribe, each man being the head of the house of his fathers. And these are the names of the men who shall assist you. From Reuben, Elizer the son of Shadir. From Simeon, Shalumiel the son of Zurashadai. From Judah, Nashan the son of Aminadab. From Issachar, Nathanael the son of Zuar. From Zebulun, Eliab the son of Helon. From the sons of Joseph, from Ephraim, Elishama the son of Amihud. And from Manasseh, Gamaliel the son of Pedazer. From Benjamin, Abidon the son of Gideoni. From Dan, Ahiezer, the son of Amishadai. From Asher, Pagiel, the son of Okran. From Gad, Eliasaph, the son of Duel. From Naphtali, Ahira, the son of Enon. These were the ones chosen from the congregation, the chiefs of their ancestral tribes, the heads of the clans of Israel. Moses and Aaron took these men who had been named, and on the first day of the second month, they assembled the whole congregation together, who registered themselves by clans, by fathers' houses, according to the number of names from twenty years old and upward, head by head, as the Lord commanded Moses. So he listed them in the wilderness of Sinai. The people of Reuben, Israel's firstborn, their generations by their clans, by their fathers' houses, According to the number of names, head by head, every male from twenty years old and upward, all who were able to go to war, those listed of the tribe of Reuben, were forty-six thousand five hundred. Of the people of Simeon? Their generations, by their clans, by their fathers' houses, those of them who were listed, according to the number of names, head by head, every male from twenty years old and upward, all who were able to go to war. Those listed of the tribe of Simeon were fifty-nine thousand three hundred. Of the people of Gad, their generations, by their clans, by their fathers' houses, according to the number of the names from twenty years old and upward, all who were able to go to war. Those listed of the tribe of Gad were 45,650. Of the people of Judah? Their generations, by their clans, by their fathers' houses, according to the number of names, from twenty years old and upward, every man able to go to war. Those listed of the tribe of Judah were 74,600. Of the people of Issachar? Their generations, by their clans, by their fathers' houses, according to the number of names, from twenty years old and upward, every man able to go to war. Those listed of the tribe of Issachar were fifty-four thousand four hundred. Of the people of Zebulun. Their generations, by their clans, by their fathers' houses, according to the number of names, from twenty years old and upward, every man able to go to war. Those listed of the tribe of Zebulun were 57,400. Of the people of Joseph, namely of the people of Ephraim. Their generations, by their clans, by their fathers' houses, according to the number of names, from twenty years old and upward, every man able to go to war. Those listed of the tribe of Ephraim were forty thousand five hundred. Of the people of Manasseh. Their generations, by their clans, by their fathers' houses, 
according to the number of names from twenty years old and upward, every man able to go to war. Those listed of the tribe of Manasseh were thirty-two thousand two hundred. Of the people of Benjamin. Their generations, by their clans, by their fathers' houses, according to the number of names from twenty years old and upward, every man able to go to war. Those listed of the tribe of Benjamin were thirty-five thousand four hundred. Of the people of Dan. Their generations, by their clans, by their fathers' houses, according to the number of names from twenty years old and upward, every man able to go to war. Those listed of the tribe of Dan were sixty-two thousand seven hundred. Of the people of Asher. Their generations, by their clans, by their fathers' houses, according to the number of names from twenty years old and upward, every man able to go to war. Those listed of the tribe of Asher were forty-one thousand five hundred. Of the people of Naphtali. Their generations, by their clans, by their fathers' houses, according to the number of names from twenty years old and upward, every man able to go to war. Those listed of the tribe of Naphtali were fifty-three thousand four hundred. These are those who were listed, whom Moses and Aaron listed with the help of the chiefs of Israel, twelve men, each representing his father's house. So all those listed of the people of Israel by their father's houses, from twenty years old and upward, every man able to go to war in Israel, all those listed were six hundred three thousand five hundred fifty. But the Levites were not listed along with them by their ancestral tribe, for the Lord spoke to Moses, saying, Only the tribe of Levi you shall not list, and you shall not take a census of them among the people of Israel. But appoint the Levites over the tabernacle of the testimony, and over all its furnishings, and over all that belongs to it. They are to carry the tabernacle and all its furnishings, and they shall take care of it, and shall camp around the tabernacle. When the tabernacle is to set out, the Levites shall take it down, and when the tabernacle is to be pitched, the Levites shall set it up. And if any outsider comes near, he shall be put to death. The people of Israel shall pitch their tents by their companies, each man in his own camp, and each man by his own standard. But the Levites shall camp around the tabernacle of the testimony, so that there may be no wrath on the congregation of the people of Israel. And the Levites shall keep guard over the tabernacle of the testimony. Thus did the people of Israel. They did according to all that the Lord commanded Moses.